Okay, this is a close-up of the reservoir again. It's 18 gallons. Uh, the actual water level is about uh, 14 to 15 gallons. Uh, it's set up so the amount of water, it's impossible for the system to overflow. It has overflow tubes on it and the amount of the water um, with the overflow tubes it makes the system impossible to overflow which is a, a nice feature. And if you can see the air stone um, again it provides oxygen for the water and uh, keeps the water oxygenated so the roots can absorb the water and uh, not drown when they're submerged in water. The system pumps the water up from the reservoir and through the bottom uh, drain and entry tubes for NFT. And as you can see, they're all getting full. The pump's on a timer. When it reaches a certain level, it shuts off. And the water drains back down the holes. Um, we also have a, something else that helps uh, with the drain so it doesn't take so long. Uh, it takes about a minute and a half for the tubes to fill up and about another uh, two to two and a half minutes for them to empty. This is repeated throughout the day, four to eight times a day uh, for ebb and flow. DNFT system, I'll show you later, it, uh, it works by the water coming to these input tubes and it uses these drain tubes which come with the uh, inserts to select the height of the water so basically with him NFT there's always water in the tube and of course it's downhill so it always flows back downhill and you can set the amount of water in the NFT system that's it I'll show you uh, the reverse position for the tubes and the NFT manifold setup and how it works.